so I did not expect to be arriving to an epic place right now. Whoa, it looks like we're driving straight into the water. Wow, look at the clouds. This is beautiful. Welcome back, everyone. We last left you on the dreamy rolling hills somewhere above San Luis Obispo where we ended up staying for three days catching up on life, taking in the views, and thoroughly enjoying the luxury of having a heater in our van. Our beautiful view is totally sunk in by the marine layer slash fog. I gotta go get back in the van. I'm freezing. It must be like 45 out. All right, Espar. It's time to work your magic. There it goes. I hear it kicking in. We got water, got rid of our recycling, dumped the trash, got groceries. Yep, van life adulting, all the chores. So I did not expect to be arriving to an epic place right now. Whoa, it looks like we're driving straight into the water. Oh, I never remember <gasps> coming. Whoa, look at the clouds. This is beautiful. This is Moro Rock, everyone. Take me out to California Take me out to California Look at those seals all over out there. It totally looks like a painting just behind you. Is this real life? Good morning. Good morning. Wait till you see where we are. Too shabby. Some surfers out there. We got seagulls all over flying around. There's little baby sand dollars out in the sand too. Last night, the night photography of more rock was amazing. The ocean, the rock glowing, and the stars, it just boom. Stars. Because it's a little bit warmer, we're gonna take advantage. We're gonna go for a little run and maybe go for a dip in the Pacific. Maybe, maybe if we can muster up the courage. But <laughs> look, look at, at these guys. surfers. They are bundled head to toe. Can we do it? I think we could pull it off. That's so zoomed in. <laughs> Time to get my running shoes on. Your turn. Mine are nice and easy. <sighs> Let's get that blood flowing. Hurrah. So we made it to the end of the trail around Moro Rock and Drew's going to teach us a little something about what the word Moro means. This huge slab of rock was the plug of an old ancient volcano and all the sediment, everything from the volcano is eroded and we're left with this beautiful piece of rock. It's a Moro which was named that by the ancient discoverers that came here years and years ago and there's a whole chain of these that goes inland to the southeast. Fascinating. You look tired. Pooped. Six and a half miles. <laughs> All right, Pacific, are we gonna do it? Maybe? Yeah, let's go jump in and liven up a little. Let's put on that water heater. Here, I'll get it. Turn on the inverter and crank that timer. My, oh my. Now that the timer is set, we can never overdo our power system and we're gonna have my, hot toasty water my. the second we get back from the ocean. Going for it. <laughs> Whose idea was this? You guys want to come in the cold, chilly water with us? Seven mile run around Moro Rock, check. Swim in the Pacific, check. 
Shower time. Almost my turn. Drew's getting his hot shower on. How's it going back here? <laughs> I can't wait. So good. Oh, this is great. Using our wilderness wash. Wilderness wash. Nature friendly soap. One towel. The best. We've been loving our little snap-on curtains. They do a great job keeping out the light and having a little dowel rod in here helps give it a bit more shape. Look at that. Got magnets around the bottom side. Yeah, and another dowel rod in the bottom so we can just roll it up and tie it up if we want. One gluten-free muffin. Ooh, it's gonna be toasty. Blueberries. <laughs> we bought frozen blueberries. They're a little bit better on the bank and they were very juicy and melty. I think I have purple lips. <laughs> For me, and cooking is extremely hard, especially when you eat. How do I get the cheese out of the bag onto the pan with the eggs? Oh my goodness. Reality of vlogging. Now that I have two eggs, this is much, much easier. <laughs> Loving these cast iron pots. The eggs are so good. Ooh, sexy breakfast scene. <laughs> Going for it. It's already 11.30. It's like mm. brunch now. Look at that oozy egg. I got it just right. You did nice. Mmm. More obey at our porthole. Babe's just finally sitting down after that epic montage of breakfast cooking. He's exhausted. But it's really freaking worth it because this view is stunning. We've been a lot of different places to have that rock outside of our door. Perfectly framed in the window is like, whoa. Oh yeah, this is nice. We love you, Moral Rock. Just really enjoyed hanging out here. We got an exercise in this morning, ate really well. We're showered, we're ready to hit the road. Headed two hours south to Santa Barbara, another magical place because we've been asked to be in a commercial shoot for Kinu, this company that makes awesome phone mounts and other accessories for people on the go. Like this one. Super stoked to be having projects on the road. We gotta go get the van clean. See ya. Look at this. You have arrived. To the car wash. Spirit, this is where you're gonna get all spruced up. Oh yeah. Spirit's gonna be clean. And I'm stoked that I'm not the one washing the van right now. <laughs> Might be the only time this happens. <laughs> I think so. Thank you, Kinu. <laughs> Spirit's all nice and shiny now. No more bugs. We just had dinner with the guy who will be shooting with us, and it sounds like a lot of fun. A full action-packed day tomorrow. So it's time for us to get some rest. Good night. We'll see you in the morning. Oh, wow. Good morning, Santa Barbara. all dialed up. We got mics. We're on our video <laughs> shoot today. They've been interviewing us, asking us about our story, van life in Europe, which in has Morocco. been a blast. Yeah. yeah. Hey guys. John's on the vlog. <laughs> John's rocking it on the camera vlog back there. John. We'll, right. we'll give you an update in a little bit. We'll be posing in front of it. <laughs> We got a bunch of GoPros mounted around the van. These palm trees look amazing off the windshield right now. Oh yeah, I love these trees. Totally 
crushing on this van right now. This could be Spirit's boyfriend. So we found ourselves in a store in Santa Barbara. We just finished the shoot with Canoe. It went great, but look at what we found. Big moment, our first time holding this book in our hands. Found it fresh off the shelf. And we're in it. We're on page 58. We don't know what picture it is yet. So we're gonna open it up and you're gonna see with us. Are you ready for this moment? Do it! Oh, that one! And I love it. That's, That's in the tulip fields of Holland. Yeah, that was like our first week on mainland Europe. Little excerpt there. You guys are gonna have to check out the book to see what it says. But that's amazing. It feels so cool to walk into a store Aww. and find us in a book. The Howler in print. For the first time, there will be more. <laughs> we made it to the pier and the view is amazing. filming and finding ourselves in a book and just it's and been a pretty epic day yeah it has been epic tomorrow we're gonna head somewhere to go seek out the super bloom we don't know where yet we're gonna do some research tonight and we'll show you when we get there flowers coming soon look at the poppies the title of the article said california's wildflowers and super bloom can be seen from space literally oh. you can see gold on our earth and it's the poppies in california look at that. that's unreal right now it's a saturday so we're gonna have to figure out something else to do in the meantime and there's a little organic fruit and veg stand right outside our door so we're gonna start there <laughs> one reusable bag and 30 seconds later, we're here to see what they have. Hi. Hello. I like artichoke hearts, your faves. Artichokes. I knew you'd be going after those. It smells so good oh here. Oh, the strawberries, they smell mm. delicious. I haven't had asparagus in forever. Cauliflower is three fifty, dollars but it's pretty giant and it's organic. And we're buying it straight from the little farmer. Let's go. Four blood oranges, one beautiful cauliflower, a bunch of asparagus, yes. two little baby sweet potatoes. And that's it. $11. Oh. Yep. Score. Oh, yeah. Ward Home Tory Pine. The wow. largest known in existence. Whoa. Look at the huge <gasps> bird's nest. This tree is massive. The canopy must be oh like my goodness. 120 feet wide. And we were parked right across the street from it. <laughs> and that's where we got our fruit and veg. For some perspective, there it is. Look at the color of the hills. Oh, wow, there's a bike trail along here. Oh, wow. What a spot. spot <laughs> nice couple just filled us in it used to be first come first serve here but this is the first year where you have to make reservations online I'm gonna check this little website out with the slip they gave us for the camping permit and see if anybody's reserved it already for the night if not it's a pretty killer spot look at that view they said it's just 30 bucks I think it's worth it how's this for a lunch spot this will do great Recon Parkway, we just kind of stumbled across it and thought it'd be a really amazing treat for ourselves to stop along this roadway and enjoy ourselves. Catch! <laughs> Whoa, look at that. It's got a really nice flavor, it's slightly tart. Oh, there goes the surf liner. I ran to get the camera, it was too fast. So that's the train that goes all the way from San Diego up to, I think, San Fran. I think. Oh. And look at these hills, they're glowing. I'm so glad we got this spot. This was completely unexpected, but who can resist that? I gotta go out there and play. Ah, what a good match. I love this game. I am going to enjoy the first Epsom bath in our tub. My feet have been sore since our run the other day, so I'm gonna go ahead and soak them and take in the view. Oh yeah, that's nice. This is a very good day. 
It seems like this episode is turning into a tour of coastal California. <laughs> Morro Bay, we got Santa Barbara, Carpinteria. Now, I don't know where we are now. Taking in the view, it's really beautiful. I don't think we're gonna be able to resist showing you the sunset. There she goes. Down, down, down. That's the horizon. Good night, son. Ya mañana. So we shared part of our space with our neighbors, and look what we they gave brought them a us. Spot, and they just brought us a whole bottle of really high class wine. It's from Mendocino County. It's good to have nice neighbors with a killer view. Yeah. Look That's at that cool. sky. What's happening in here? Fresh organic Lots of roasted garlic. Alright, I'm gonna get back to tending the fire. I'll come back when it smells even better. The final touches. Yay. What kind of cuisine are we eating? Fresh Californian cuisine. Dinner time. This is our view from bed this morning. Got a nice pot of porridge to share by the sea. Hey, handsome. <sighs> so unfortunately, we have to be out of this spot by 11 a.m. if we're not staying another night. And we're still chasing the super bloom, so we're heading out of here. But our super sweet neighbors, the ones who gave us the bottle of wine last night, they told us that there's coin showers just at the end of this. So we're gonna go get our shower on. Bye, beautiful spot. Might as well take care of our chores. <laughs> Love when it's right out the window. Delivery. <sighs> we don't know how much these are gonna cost, so I'm going prepared. See you on the clean side. Let's go! Sony, turn off. How was that shower? It was worth it. How many quarters did you use? A dollar's worth. I did seven quarters. It ran out just as I was putting soap all over my face. <laughs> I think the best part of it was that I could scrub my hair while still having hot water pour on my body because in our outdoor shower right now, we don't yet have something to hang our shower head on. So you're always holding it like this, one yeah. hand. Usually we like to get really sweaty before we treat ourselves to like a legit shower like that. Our first non-vam shower since Florida in two weeks. Yeah, that's pretty That's pretty, impressive. pretty impressive. Oh yeah. Let's hit the road. to be sitting back in our seats ready to hit the road. It always feels good to get on the road, but we're having a really hard time leaving the coastline today. It's chill Sunday vibes. The surfers are out, palm trees, the birds are chirping. We got these amazing green hills that are covered in wild yellow flowers, but we hear the super blooms really amazing in some other parts, so we're gonna try to get to that. And it's only gonna last a couple more weeks, so we've been lucky enough that the super bloom is still happening, so we have to go share that with you guys. We we gotta go chase it. We have to leave the coast somehow. When we used to live here years ago, it was during the drought and everything was just brown all the time. So this is a really special time. It usually only happens once in a decade in California. So stay tuned, give this video a like and be sure to subscribe and hit that bell so you can join us next week when we share the super bloom and start finishing the build on Spirit again. So we'll be reuniting with San Diego Urban Timber and taking you along with as we use repurposed wood to make the cabinetry, ceilings, countertops. You are going to be blown away. Follow along. We got a lot in store and really appreciate your input in the comments below. See you next week. See ya. Bye.